I've been a personal trainer for 20 years, and the reason why I tell people that is just because it's always been my passion to help people. In 2014, I started a new job, and little did I know that that building was going to be my demise. But at the same time, we had also moved into a new house, which I didn't know also had mold. I would, I would feel fevered often, you know, I never woke up feeling rested. And slowly these progressed, but when I started working in the mold, so I was basically being double exposed unknowingly at work, at home, constantly hit. Going through the system, everything was blamed on my fibroid or mental health. There was never any true digging. I was lost in the system about my, my symptoms, about the fibroid. It took an unfortunate miscarriage in... Um, 2018 and I had actually gotten so sick that I went on a medical leave in January of 2018 so it was the miscarriage that was finally flagged um, the fertility clinic because you know we've been struggling with fertility as well that oh maybe she does need surgery maybe this giant mass is affecting her fertility so for me it was like okay that's going to be the golden ticket right like I'm going to get this thing out and I'm going to have my life back because at that night, I was waking up exhausted. I was on the couch. I was lucky if I got the dishes done. You know, I told my psychologist at the time that I felt like I was literally living in the twilight zone because my day would go by so slow while living it. But yet at the end of the day, it was like, where did my day go? Because I also was having extreme memory loss. I was stuttering. You know, I was not speaking proper sentences. I was just really falling apart. And... After the surgery, unfortunately, nothing changed. So I started digging. Um, I reached out to a naturopathic doctor. At that point, I was like, all right, let's do some tests because there's got to be more. And at that point, I was, I was frankly, I was suicidal. I didn't want to live anymore. I had over 70 symptoms and I had an organic acid test. And lo and behold, my entire body wasn't working. So I had mitochondria dysfunction. I wasn't methylating. I was full of mold and candida. It was just, my body was a hot mess. It needed a lot of love. So 